Some of us have waited patiently for winter to end. Mike Stevens says it already has in the PhotoLink library. We didn't get much in the way of memorable snowfalls this winter. Sandra Wall of Falls brought this one to my attention. Personally, I'm more of a happy not to see you winter kind of guy. Ben Stein, Fleetville caught the morning of such a day. Hmm. And they say dreams don't come true. Lorraine Zakovich Blickley found a Sunday ride near Orwigsburg to her liking. Smooth ride here. Diane Beckett, Frackville came out in the fog one day. Gives a different view of the world, I would say. Diane likely saw some interesting sights as Mary Esther Ward of Sylvania did here. The field of cows. Mm, looks like a good crop. New sites pop up daily in spring, as do visitors, some looking for a bite to eat. Tammy Hovancic of Music spotted one. A backyard bird on a similar mission captured by Cynthia Roth, Catawissa. Wait a few minutes and a scene such as this one from Avis Miller Berwick will give you a different image to consider. Wait long enough, as Robert Jones of Susquehanna County did, and you just might get an image like this. Sunset at Crystal Lake. These days, new color, fresh buds are sometimes at our feet. Deb from Danville found this while on a walk. Spring is here, writes Charlie Burroughs in Luzerne County. It surely is. Bill Glavich of Mount Cobb confirms that position with his proof. Look closely in these blooms from Carol Felix, Berwick, and you might be able to see a worker that never quits. You can be pretty certain of that. From Beth Wellman, Clark Summit, one last look at a site of promise, of color, a hint as to what lies ahead. Capture it and send it on into the PhotoLink Library. I'm Mike Stevens.